All right, this is what I'm working on today. Mini Cooper. Let's see what he backed into it. fix this car up, make it look like it didn't happen. Get a lot of that out. Now this layer right here, a little, a little further back from the inside, so I'm gonna glue pull that nice and straight. Then I'll be able to finish this out. But my dent dial got in there, straightened out this edge, and then also got behind the double layer, which kind of starts up, up here. And I was able to straighten that out as much as I can, but now it's time for some power glue pulling. Okay, next up, Got a nice big tab on there. I'm gonna get my 35 heavy, set it up for glue pulling. The sheet metal on the car is no match for a 35 heavy. Yeah, that's good enough. Look how far out that is. That's about what I need right there. Nice. Oh, that straightened it out nicely. Okay, now that I got that body line nice and straight, you know, I'm not gonna get in here with a glue tab and spend a long time pulling that out. You're gonna fight the crowns. Just don't do it, it's a waste of time. Um, now that this is all apart, I found a nice plug up inside here that's going to help me get a tool behind that and get that out quick. There we go. Blue pulling did help bring out that kind of that overall radius. But now it's time for some detailing and glue pulling is not the choice in this case. Tooling will get it done. Okay, so here's the point I got to get to. There's the hole. So if you look at this, uh, you probably already guessed it's going to be a hook tool or kind of a J tool. It's a short one, that's what you want. You don't want a lot of, you don't want any length on it because you want some real torque. So I got a 3 8 socket on there. There's my hole, and look at that, lined up perfectly. I'm going to get right in there and torque that out. See why pushing with a tool is way faster, way better than pulling with glue tabs. Much more control, especially if you add an extension like this, better on your wrist. You don't want to get tools where you have to use your hand and your wrist here. It's coming out. Just had to go in from the uh, the light in here. So look at the setup you get with a dentile. You get the base off of the uh, inner frame, and you get some great pushing. So that's how you set up a dentile. No problem inside here. You get leverage. Lots of power. 
and you can hold it with one hand. Okay, all done with this Mini Cooper before I put that trim back on and the light. This thing is done. It has this natural turn right in here, but all came back. Mini Cooper, all done. For watching this is Sal from Dent Experts the YouTube channel fixing this Mini Cooper the sheet metal on the car is no match for a 35 heavy yeah that's good enough the setup you get with a dentile as you can see glue pulling will only take you so far in a repair many many more times you actually have to push the dent out from behind well, thanks for watching. Visit DentDial.com and get your 35 Heavy Duty today.